share with you um, the page that I made today in my junk journals. This page is made with um, rust dyed paper, notebook paper. I just stuck it onto the page and then I used two doilies this time so one stays on the page and one doesn't so you can tuck something under there. And the same on this side. And I like how the green from the lines ended up on the side when it was finished drying. And those little lines at the top. It's pretty neat too. And I did this in all seven of the journals, but it was a little bit different in each one, so I thought I would share with you. This paper ended up having like little bubbles on it. I liked that. And when I when I do it, I just use a paintbrush, a big one, to paint it on. And then let it sit in the the water. And I think that's what causes the bubbles. And this one is just stapled on. And go to the next one. This one, I just use pieces of paper that I had left over from another cutting and glued them together to make one page. And on to the next book. This one was kind of neat because um, one of my children had drawn with a marker on the paper that I had chosen to dye. And so when it came out, it has those little splotches of red. It's really neat. Oh yeah, I'll go ahead and show you this. Um, on the previous day, I put this nice um, lace in. And then I decided today I wanted to dress it up a little. And put some color with some markers. That turned out pretty neat. Okay, and then... On this one, I had a lot of those cool bubbles. It's about the same as another one I had. But I did not fold the doily in half this time. I put a larger piece of it on that side. I thought it just looked neat. And it turned out really good. And for the last one, smaller shoe. Mm -hmm. This one, I made a flip up. It has that pretty colors on it. It bled. Oops, I have just one page on that one. And then, let's see if we can find it. Here it is. This one I combined just the regular um, typing paper with the notebook paper. It was just the cutoffs. That looked pretty neat. And that's all for today. Thank you for joining us.